guest house that looked good enough to eat, and a great web series for flower lovers. This week on Style with a Smile. Welcome to Style with a Smile. I'm your host, Jonathan Fong. And yes, my hair is natural. Well, it is natural, but the color's not. This week's Web Wow is a weekly web series for anyone who loves flowers. And I'm not talking about my own show here. This is a website called ubloom.com that's been created by my friend Jay Schwanke, who is the country's top expert on flowers. The weekly webisodes on ubloom.com will give you great floral arranging tips and also ideas for the proper care of flowers and new developments in the floral and event industries. You know, I learn something new every time I go on ubloom.com, and I think you will too. Plus, Jay's just really entertaining. Now, this week's Wow To video is something that you may have seen me demonstrate already because it's the video that I submitted to the Oprah Win Your Own Show contest. People are always asking me what happened with that. Well, I never heard from them. And all I could think is that they were just too scared because my video was so good. But here is the whole unedited version of that video because when I submitted it, I had to get it under three minutes. So this is my own show now and I can talk as long as I want. When you have people over, you want to spruce up the house and a great place to start is with the bathroom. I'm going to show you a fun way to display guest hand towels in your bathroom. Now, when I'm at somebody else's house for a party and I use the bathroom, I don't know which towels to use a lot of times. I don't want to use the bath towels because I feel like they're private. And then the hand towels, everybody's been using them so they're a little damp and I don't want to touch them. So that's why guest hand towels are so nice to have at a party. I'm going to show you a fun way to display guest hand towels in the shape of cupcakes. Yes, cupcakes. Who doesn't love cupcakes? They just remind me of childhood. When I was in elementary school, my grandpa Oliver used to make cupcakes for our school bake sales and I would eat half of them before they'd go to school. So the school was not making very much money off of me. But anyway, I digress. So let me show you how to make them. The recipe is very easy. First, preheat the oven to 375. Just kidding, there's no cooking involved. Get out of the kitchen and come back here and watch my demo. <laughs> We're gonna start with the cupcake wrappers first. To make the cupcake wrappers, I've made this template that you can download on my website, stylewithasmile.tv, and then print it out yourself on your own scrapbook paper. That's what I've done right here, and we'll just trim along the lines. I can't cut a straight line if my life depended on it but it's just close enough, which is one of my mottos. People will not be measuring your cupcake wrapper to see how well it's been cut. Now for the top of the cupcake wrappers, I'm using scalloped edge scissors that I got at the scrapbooking store because it gives it a really nice edge, just like real cupcake wrappers do. And ta-da, here we are. So we'll glue the ends together with a glue stick. Then it glues right together. And you have this cute little cupcake wrapper. So next, let's fold the towels into the shape of cupcakes. It's the fun part. Take your towel and set it down diagonally and then fold it into a strip of about two inches wide. Then take one end of the towel and roll it up. Now to give it more of a cupcake shape, squeeze the bottom and then fluff out the top. And then set it right inside the cupcake wrapper. How cute is that? Every time I look at one of these I smile. But we're not finished yet because we need a little cherry on top. And that's where the lollipops come in. Just stick in the lollipop 
in the middle, and you get this cute little cupcake. That's actually a guest hand towel. Put them all on a platter, and your guests will love it. Oh, hi, you're back. I'm just waiting for Oprah to call. So if she calls, I have to get it, okay? In the meantime, look what I did with the cupcakes. I put them in a cupcake box. Look how cute that is. Presentation is everything, and this would be a great way to give these as a gift. Well, if you like this episode, be sure to tell your friends, share it on Facebook and Twitter, write a comment below, and join us next week for Style with a Smile. Ring, ring, ring. Oh, <laughs>